and say they heard it from their living rooms, but they came running outside because they knew this was bad. The man behind the wheel was just walked out of the 13th precinct here in handcuffs. 26-year-old Malbab Ali, charged with drunk driving and manslaughter, he said nothing as reporters shouted questions at him. People are on the floor. It's like a triage center. People crying on the corner, so that was hard to see. Uh, a lot of screaming and commotion, everyone coming out from the stores. An out-of-control speeding gray Hyundai Sonata and the drunk driver behind the wheel, killing a 23-year-old man as he was walking in the crosswalk. It was clear that one person was in very bad shape, um, and so a lot of people kind of, a couple people went to pray over him. The collision mangled the sedan's hood, its passenger side crumbled, and a delivery bike twisted from the impact. It sounded like a, the loudest bang I had ever heard, something falling from the sky. We saw the car. Here up on the sidewalk, we saw a woman on the ground over there and the driver on the ground on this side of the car. It happened on 3rd Avenue at 21st Street in Gramercy Park last night. The man behind the wheel, 26-year-old Mahbub Ali from Queens, seen here being handcuffed by cops. Police think he may have swerved to avoid a cyclist around 8 p.m., lost control, jumped the curb, and crashed into four people. A 27-year-old female pedestrian suffered a fractured leg. A 21-year-old male pedestrian suffered a laceration to his left leg. And an 18-year-old cyclist suffered leg and back injuries. A 25-year-old female passed of the Hyundai also broke her right leg. There was a man sitting right here up against this pole uh, holding his leg. That victim, a migrant with a cast on his leg, today on crutches. The former NYPD Academy's gym around the corner now being used to house asylum seekers. This is an area where a lot of the immigrants that are staying at the Gramercy Training Academy uh, hang. You know, they're, they're shoulder to shoulder, head to toe there. They're outside. Now, that migrant with that broken leg has been released. There are, meanwhile, other victims who remain in critical condition. Reporting live in Gramercy Park, Stefan Kim, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Stefan, thank you.